Hi everyone, Quincy here. In this video, we will demonstrate how to use CyberArk identity flows to communicate with ServiceNow via REST API. For those who may not be familiar with identity flows, it is a no-code, low-code orchestration tool designed to automate workflows and eliminate manual tasks. Equipped with a user-friendly low-code visual editor and a drag-and-drop interface, Identity Flows enables the creation of automated processes. It also provides a range of pre-built and custom connectors, allowing seamless integration with external applications, including ServiceNow. To begin, let's log in to the CyberArk Identity Security Platform, which we will refer to as the Platform throughout this video. Once logged in, navigate to the Flows section and select the specific flows relevant to this demonstration. Each circle within the flows represents an action performed via the REST API. Identity flows can authenticate and obtain an OAuth token to establish communication with services on the platform. Subsequently, we can fetch an access token from the platform via OIDC, OpenID Connect. With the access token at hand, we can retrieve the required secrets from Conjure Cloud. Let's verify the accuracy of the secret path. This can be easily done by browsing Conjure Cloud and searching for the secret path. To ensure secure operations, we have already onboarded the ServiceNow API key onto the platform in advance. This API key can be fetched by Identity Flows enabling security measures such as secret rotation through CyberArk Privilege Cloud. Applications can retrieve the API keys using Conjure Cloud. The final step involves communicating with ServiceNow. Using the fetched secrets, Flows will initiate a REST API call to ServiceNow to retrieve the required information. Now that everything is ready, let's execute these flows by clicking the Run button. In addition to manual execution, flows can also be triggered via webhooks or scheduled tasks. Once the execution is complete, we can review the log by clicking the bell button and selecting the latest run. Let's expand the log to examine the details of the last step. As displayed on the screen, the API has successfully retrieved four items of information. And there you have it. This demonstrates how CyberArk identity flows can effectively facilitate communication with ServiceNow using the REST API. This is Quincy from CyberArk. Thanks for watching.